Amid growing concerns of a potential widespread avian flu outbreak, an Ohio egg farm is slated to cull 1.35 million hens following the confirmation of a case within the flock this week. The move is in line with efforts by the U.S. Department of Agriculture to curb the virus's spread. While the early 2022 epidemic has shown fewer instances of the virus among wild birds, the overall toll on the poultry industry has been substantial, with 8.1 million birds culled this year. Notably, 5.8 million of these deaths occurred this month, affecting sizable egg farms across the country. Iowa, the largest egg producer in the U.S., bore the brunt, losing approximately 17.3 million birds. Ohio, though a significant egg-producing state, has seen a comparatively lower toll, with 5.1 million birds culled due to bird flu. Avian flu cases have surfaced in various states, including Minnesota, Maryland, South Dakota, Wisconsin, Georgia, and California. The most significant incident this week involved the culling of 198,200 chickens at a Maryland farm. In 2022, a staggering 58 million birds fell victim to the epidemic, with wild birds acting as vectors through their droppings and nasal secretions. Farmers are intensifying preventive measures such as sanitizing vehicles, enforcing clothing changes and showers for employees entering barns, and employing separate equipment for each barn. However, safeguarding against the virus in major migratory bird routes remains challenging. Officials assure the public that avian flu poses minimal health risks, with few reported human cases and strict regulations preventing infected birds from entering the food chain. Adequate cooking, reaching 165 degrees Fahrenheit, 73.89 degrees Celsius, is emphasized as a reliable means of eliminating any viruses present in eggs and poultry. The ongoing efforts underscore the industry's commitment to mitigating the impact of avian flu and ensuring the safety of both poultry and consumers.